Hi guys, Mr. Jaeger here, and welcome back to the Fallout Front. So, in the last episode, we began our epic journey to head southwards towards, uh, or southwest towards, oops, towards the uh, blood bank. But then we bumped into a farmer just a little bit after we headed out, and we spoke to um, a farmer who lost his daughter to raiders. So we kind of went over to the uh, radio tower, killed all the raiders, stole the uh, locket back, and now we're making our way once again to start off. Oh, by the way, unfortunately, I've had to abandon having that railroad uh, uniform because, regretfully, if I wear it, uh, I don't think it was designed with the pip pad in mind because, unfortunately, that's what happens. It's nice. It looks cool. But, unfortunately, yeah. I mean, on the outside, if I was able to run around on the outside, it works. But, for some reason, when you're in first person, it just makes it look like you've lost a part of your arm. So, for immersion's sake, I suppose, and also because it's probably going to drive some of you mad, we're just going to roll with the Vault 111 suit. And it's alright, we still have the protective bonuses of, well, somewhat of a protective bonus of the Vault 111 suit, but, yeah. Oh, look, the glowing sea, which is terrifying. I'm not looking forward to going into that, I will tell you now. Okay. So, let's go jump. <clears throat> Anyway, that pro he's probably asleep by now. Hello. That locket? I've got that locket back for you. Are you serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. I'm sure she'll go lean on a price tag for what she's done. And feel free to use our workshop. At least we can get it. No problem at all. There we go. Move to you. Oh, look at a kitty. Anyway, so yes, he survived the whole the whole. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry, that was rather entertaining. Um, hey, Stanhand Grenades. But that comes out of the... S oh, okay. That's cool. That's fine. I, I like that. Uh, now, let's roll with this for a time being, because I have a lot of ammo for this. Yes. Right, let's, uh, let's do slight exploration, I suppose. But yeah, that's nice. We've, we've done a good deed. And, better still, we've ranked up. And now I know exactly what I'm doing. There we go. That's going to help us out a lot in the future. Having that early on is going to make my life so much nicer. What's that? Oh, it's my favorite things in the world. Oh! Get wrecked! Yeah. That's right, you disgusting vermin. You die a miserable, painful death. Get wrecked. Right, let's have a little look inside this little settlement. If I could figure out how to get in. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's nice. It's a nice little quaint environment. And I kind of forgot to... Uh... Oh, and the next time I level up. Ooh, medkit. Ah, oh, gotta have your stim packs. It's a little bit broken that you, in this game that you get so many stim packs, but... Eh. Uh, 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 oh, God. Yep. <laughs> Let's not get irradiated. That's it. Right, run away. Ah! Slight irradiation there, but that's okay. I'm going the wrong way. Okay, let's just... just there we go. Right, to the base. Again, this area is probably going to be slightly higher level for me because it's kind of in a mid to, I'd say it was a mid to high level area. Ah, damn it. Ah, crap. Okay. Is there a dam over there? There is. Uh, it looks like it's a little bit faster to go that way, so we'll go that way. Oh, oh yeah, shit. My alerts. I'll have to be careful for them. Oh, that made me jump. See the tension? I can feel the tension in this game. It's incredible. I love it. So awesome. Dog meat, stop attracting the Milex. The music is giving me a, oh, could you be fucked? Or could you not be fucked? We don't know. But there's a Milex somewhere. Well, there's the old factory area. We will be doing that quest, I imagine, at some point. It's one of those sort of, if we want to progress further into the game, we kind of have to do that. Though, I'm a little in debates as to, ooh. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Uh, 
curfew. Let me through. I'm on important military business. Analyzing vocal patterns. Confidence interval, 60%. Aww. You may pass. I kind of wish we had that. Will you comply? Will you comply? Will you? Attention all citizens. A mandatory curfew. <laughs> Let's just, uh, just check which has my most damaging weapon. That's damage. Damage. Well, the pipe shotgun is apparently the most dangerous. <laughs> oh, good God, he's way high level. Well, there goes dog meat. Yeah, hi, sorry, didn't mean to do that. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, really? Now you decide you need to reload. Ah! <laughs> oh, shit. My head's crippled. That's lovely. Right, let's select some explosives. Got ya. Not that fire damage does anything to a robot, but you never know. Shh, sucker. So yeah, this is the kind of thing I was talking about, about me not doing something stupid. Well, me doing something stupid. Where is he gone? Oh crap. God damn. Boom. Check that shit out. Fusion cell. And I've ranked up. Isn't that lovely? Right. That's going to be a nice little perk. So, there we go. Nice little combat session for you there. Bit of a waste of time if, you, if, if we're being perfectly honest. But hey, I wasn't being perfectly honest. Ah, oh, we can't go in there. That sucks. Alright. Okay, so we're making our way up through this area. I have to admit, I've not been through this area much. Oh no, I have. My apologies. Sorry, I completely lost track of where I was for a second. Wait a minute, this area seems very familiar. No, I have been through here. This is where feral ghouls are. Memory serves correctly. Hello? There's the uh, hippie, uh, hippie droid. One of these buildings has ghouls in it. Oh, hello. There's one. And, of course, big bugs. Hi. Die. Bottle cap. Good. Industrial solvent. You could have used it on the blood bug, but... Oh, my blood bug. Yeah, we're going to encounter those if we uh, get moving fast enough in this episode, so I'm not looking forward to that. Really not looking forward to that. Yeah, my nose. A cursed thing. Oh, wow! Never seen this before. Is this like a... Oh, it is! Wow. That's awesome. Kind of looks impractical for this area, but sure. Like, judging from the size of it and everything. Ooh. 
Okay, we might have to avoid that area a little bit, because I think we have to sneak by. You can you can just about see in the distance there the area I was talking about. Hang on. Yeah, if you look to the if you look to the top left, that should be that should be the military complex. Oops. Yeah. Yeah, because that's where yeah, so that is where we need to go, but unfortunately we're gonna have to sneak by. Joy to the world. We will be coming back through here, but if we do, if we start going through here now, we're going to start, um... Oh, you made me bloody jump. I thought that was a bear. Oh no, I wasn't mistaken. That is a bear. Where is the bear? Where is the bear? Where is the bear? That's a ragstag doe. Don't go near the ragstag doe. That's a bear house. Is that a bear house? Okay. Yeah, let's not go there. Let's really not go there. Let's avoid that place at all costs, shall we? There's a good not dying. Oh, hello. Sort of a river-esque environment. This is a lovely night. Oh, it's a full moon as well. That's even... Huh. Right, that's a lot of destroyed stuff. What the? Shit! Dog meat, what the fuck did you just do? Yeah, that's a fucking raider and power armor. Let's get going. I'm a little bit nervous about going through here, so... Oh, look at this game! Oh, so good! Right, I think we're okay. It's like various areas you can explore, but it's awesome. Oh, sort of a slightly more expanded area. But no, today... No, today we shall pursue and charge and... Oh, this game just... Oh... Oh, look, the moon isn't going... It's moving, but not at the rate of knots. What's that over there? Oh, shit, it's a raider. Uh, we can take on a raider. I just need to find an eye on him. He's dead. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, what a shot. Nice. Ooh, left greaves. Nice. Oh, patrolman sunglasses. I like how, despite exploding your head, I can still retrieve your sunglasses. Alright, let's see what you had here. Oh, nothing. Good. Right, okay. We're nearly there. I regret to say we are nearly there. I n oh, this area seems pretty open, which is making me nervous, because normally that's a, that's a telltale sign. Ah, but though, that's the uh, satellite. In the last episode, I mentioned about how there was a satellite arrays that you could sort of set up. That's what they look like. Now, again, I have no... I Ooh, tank. Again, I have no idea as to... Uh... Oh, damn. Poor bastard. I have no idea as to uh... what happens if you actually set all of them up. So, if, you'd like me to... if you guys want to let me know in the comment section below... That would be immensely awesome because then I can learn if it's worth working those things or not. And yes, welcome to the military base. The area that you're not really meant to go to until like mid to late game when you have to find Kellogg. Spoiler warning. Oh, this game's been out for over two years, so it's fine. If you're watching this, then you'll no doubt have... Uh, you'll have either played through the game already, or you're not too fussed about certain spoilers. I won't go mad on the spoiler frontier, but areas you have to engage, you know, I'll just say Kellogg. I won't say who he is or what he's doing, but Kellogg. Oh, dude, how awesome would it be if you could use this in the game? I always kind of wondered what, whether or not it would actually be a feasible military concept to use two barrels in a massive gun. There's Fort Hagen, which is nice. We've got our nice little buff of experience there and almost immediately afterwards as I really don't like this we make our way towards 
the oh, shit. Oh no! What? It was a bottle cap. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh, don't do this to me. Oh, the first death. It was because I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> so we're back, and. Right, there it is. Let's quickly nab it. There we go. Right. <laughs> Let's try that again, shall we? Okay, so this, unfortunately, is the famous... I don't want to get too close. I want to discover it, but I don't want to get too close. Eh. There we go. The Greater Mass Blood Clinic. This is probably my least favorite bit about this entire game. There are... You know, at the moment, I've yet, as I said, yet to do the DLC. But there are numerous reasons as to why I fucking hate this bit. First of all, those things. But block flies aren't great. It's not the biggest thing. But look. Look. You see that there? Do you see that there? That, my friends, is a blood, um, blood bug. Uh, that is another reason why I really, really don't like this bit. But the number one reason why this bit gives me freaking nightmares every time I start this game. Fuck you. Oh, by the way, my non-swearing, my no-swearing policy is going to kind of go out the window for this episode. Because I will be swearing quite a ver vermintly. Fuck you. Um, yes, I will be doing that. I will be getting that and some. Hello, we've got another one inbound. Where are you going? There is another section of this place. And if you guys have played through this game before, you no doubt will know what I am talking about. Ah, oh, shit. Dog me! You know that whole protect me and shit? How about you actually do that? Thank you. Well, okay, I will add another reason why I'm not a big fan of this area. It's all close quarters. Yeah, great job protecting me, dog meat. You're such a valued companion. Where are you? Uh, yes, actually, very good idea, dog meat. No, don't go back out, you pleb. Right, let's, um, let's open this out just in case. Okay, let's go back to the sniper rifle. Fuck you. Oh, God. Oh, I am! Fuck you! Fucking die! Game! Ugh. Disgusting vermin. Seriously, if I could nuke this place again with all the bugs inside that thermo detonator, I would. Right, anyway. So, yes. Now that we'll go back to that. Fuck you. Right, I believe that might be all of them. But we will have to see. Okay, so, yes. I'll grab his stuff as well. Ooh, a bowler hat. Nice. I won't be uh, too much of an ass to him. Actually, this would prove useful to be... Uh, for this thing to work. Nope, not this thing. This thing. I don't know how effective it is against bugs. But, we will see. Okay, that made my heart stop. The way that bloody person's um, stuff was w wrapping in the wind. I thought, honest to God, it was going to be... Ooh, cage armor. I might grab the... Oh. Oh, we'll see what happens. Um, right, I know there's one of these little bastards up top. It's a really disgusting thing. Any Anyone who's not a fan of big bugs in this game. Oh, there it is. Nope, I'm going to murder all of you. Die. I will sacrifice dog meat for the glory of the not getting fucked by... Oh, God, it's a legendary one as well. Okay, this is working better than I intended. I'm ha I'd happily let dog meat get ripped apart by those things. Right, blood bug. Okay, there's another one. There is another one. Yes, dog meat, I realize you might be slightly pissed off at me, but I don't care. It's for the cause of killing all those bugs. 
And that's worth it, in my opinion. Hmm? Of course I fall into a bloody hole. Not entirely sure how that reloading mechanic works, but you know what? I'm not going to question it. Dog meat, go hunting. For God's sake. Okay, I've killed all the bugs in here. Good. So Fucking hell. Okay. We're okay. We're fine. Don't you make those bug sounds, because I know I will use my gun on you. Right. Let's unlock this door very carefully and very quickly. Just so, so that way we don't have to worry about the other problem. Oh, will you open, you little shit? There we go. That's it. Right now I'm in a high stress environment because this is the th this is something I'm honestly quite scared. Well, not scared. I am intensely grossed out by these things, and having them blurt in my face is something I rather would like to avoid. Okay, we need to clear this upper floor section though. Right. Okay. I really am also getting fed up by the fact that there's no such thing as bloody floors. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Fuck this shit, I'm out! Okay. I hate this level. I hate this bit so fucking much. I fucking hate this bit so much. I really cannot stand this bit. It is a very, very frustrating and very, very intense section of this game. And who would have thought? Ah! Okay, this thing is actually quite nice against bugs, but I keep spending too much ammo on it. Okay, we've got like eight minutes. Not good. Means I have to hurry up, which is something I'd rather not do. Okay, so that's another reason why I hate this bit. Because of how close proximity everything is. Um, you don't really get much of an opportunity to uh, run, in my case. It's, this, You know what? This may be something completely useless to you. And you may think I'm being really silly and cowardly for not liking this bit. But I just, I do not like humongous bugs. I am quite terrified of humongous bugs this this right here this bit right here is the worst section of fallout 4 for me if this bit is the equivalent of a fucking nightmare that i would have as a child and i would wake up sweating and cursing every kind of thing maybe not the bottle cap because i'm gonna panic throw okay so in this room dog beat you fucking idiot Fuck that shit, I'm out. Enjoy the death. Ah! I can hear him as well. It's, it's horrible. I can hear the fucking thing. Oh, lovely. It's not dead. And I don't have any other fucking weapons, do I? Or chuckable weapons. No, I've got a mol lot of. Run thy fuck away. Dog meat, you know what to do. Ah! Oh god damn it. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you. I hate you. Oh my god, that made me jump. <laughs> right. Oh, the sound of the freaking Oh! I hate the sound! Oh! It's horrible! No! Oh, I can't! Oh! Oh! I don't like it! Oh, it's there, there! Fuck off. Dog meat, can you please kill this thing? Come on. Yes. Yes. Come on. Oh, God.
I hate this game. Fuck you. Fuck you. I hate you. Right. Minigun. We're going for it. Really don't want to. I really don't want to. I really wish I had a grenade right now. I fucking wish I had a grenade. It's stupid as fuck. And I'm probably gonna die. But I really... Sorry, dog meat. Yeah, it's seen me. Keep coming this way, dog meat. Oh, god damn it. Uh, I hate this so much. Die! You disgusting vermin. Oh my god. Did we actually fucking do it? Oh my god, I think we actually did it. And I actually did that in one episode. I was expecting to do this in like fucking god knows how many times. Oh, it's not the end of the game. 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 We're not- We are not- We are not out of this by a fucking mile. Right, that's a dead one. Dog meat. I appreciate you're gonna want to stick close, but please don't. Okay, here comes the nervous racking pot. Okay. <sighs> the game is saying well done. <sighs> this I this game fuck it so hard. Just fuck it so hard. Fuck this game so hard. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I've just removed all essence of my maturity and oh, God's sake. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Right. So yes, all essence of my strength, manliness, or whatever bullshit just went straight out the window, and I apologise for screaming in your microphone. I'm probably gonna try and lower that down a bit. Oh God, that terrified me. I hate this fucking game. This game can go suck it. Oh, God. Right, anyway. So, that's one little mini quest. Oh, miss, miss, miss click. That's one little... It's the ugly one as well. Okay, there's nothing. Okay, so, there you go. That's the, uh... That's the end of this quest. The first quest in our... Mission to complete this game. Oh, God. So, right. Now that that's done, we've got like minutes to finish this episode. So, yes. The rough plan is... Let's get upstairs. Avoid the blood bug. Okay. So, from here, what we need to do now... Is go to... Is to go down here to this little section here. Across the bridge over to Diamond City. Whereupon we'll start encountering other people. So... With that said, thank you very much for doing watching this. I hope you have enjoyed. I hope you also have better hear have slightly better hearing after that scream. And thank you again for watching. If you like this kind of content, let me know in the comment section down below and other such things. I will see you guys next time. This is Miss Jaeger, Mr. Jaeger, signing out.